Milwaukee man speeding away from police crashes right through two backyards near 55th and Chambers. That chase finally came to an end near Tetonia and Center. Angelica Sanchez with a closer look at the damage and how neighbors are reacting to the chase. A 27 year old Milwaukee man took police on a chase that came to a halt here near Tetonia and Center. Police say they had to use stop sticks. Police say the chase began close to 10 Tuesday night when police found the suspect driving recklessly near 18th and Brown Street. But the bulk of the damage you see on your screen likely came from here, 55th and Chambers, where police say the suspect drove onto private property. The light of day really shows the destruction left by the suspect vehicle. You will see tables and chairs flipped over one yard. The suspect vehicle plowing through another neighbor's yard going right through their fence. This could have really been something terrible. This is neighbor Rose Scott's backyard. She is not comfortable going on camera, but she is questioning this police chase. Why would you chase a car this late at night through a neighborhood like ours? She feels the chase should have been called off when it turned onto her block. From my standpoint, it was an uncalled for pursuit. Even though police say he was driving recklessly? Yes, yes. Why put me at risk? Because he was driving uh, recklessly. We asked MPD for more information into the police chase, but they say for now, no further information will be available. In the meantime, police say they found what they believe are illegal drugs in the suspect vehicle. Charges against the 27 year old Milwaukee man are expected in the coming days. In Milwaukee, Angelica Sanchez, Fox 6 News. And Milwaukee police say that 27 year old suspect was arrested and treated at a local hospital for non life threatening injuries.